Hi everyone, in this video we will make loading screen in Unity. Let's start. First of all, we have a load button to load the scene and we have a loading panel to show doing loading. In this panel, there are loading bar and fill image. We need to choose fill images type as field and method as horizontal. And while our scene is loading, we'll show the progress value using fill amount. And the panel should be disabled by default. And we have two scenes. One is our main scene and the other is the scene we want to open. Make sure these scenes are added to build settings. And we'll use the index of the scene we'll open. Now let's start the coding part. We create a new script and name it loading scene and open the script. First of all we define the loading screen that we want to activate. And we import Unity Engine UI, then we define our fill image. Then we define a method named loading scene, and this method takes a scene ID parameter of type int. We'll fill this method later. We create an I enumerator named load scene async, and this method also takes an int type parameter. Then we create an async operation. Async operation is process whose execution can proceed independently or in the background. So we'll control the scene loading process with async operation. Then we define the load scene method of scene manager for this operation. Then we create a while loop. In this loop, if the operation is not completed, we return a null value and create a float type progress value. In order to reflect this value to the fill image, we use the math clamp01 method and divide the operation progress by 0.9. Then we give this value to loading bar fill dot fill amount. And we activate the loading screen before the while loop. And finally, we call this method in load scene. We have to call i enumerator method using start coroutine, otherwise it won't work. And that's it. Then let's open our scene and create an empty game object and drag our script here. Then let's drag the loading screen object and the loading bar fill object into their places. And finally, let's call the load scene method in the on click event of the load button. If we look at the scene ID again, we can see that the scene we want to open index value is 1. So let's write 1 to scene ID. And that's it. Let's test it now. As you can see, the loading screen is activated and then the loading bar starts to fill up and finally our scene is loaded. This loading process will vary depending on the speed of your computer or device. We are done. If you like this video, please subscribe also leave a comment. See you in the next video.